Yo guys, how's it going? And today I have got a brand new video here for you today to feast your eyes upon. And uh, today's video is of course a Q&A, as you can tell by the title. Um, I thought I'd just do this because I wanted to just bang out a video. As long as I'm like, I, I, I'm trying to keep the consistency uh, to the best of my ability at the minute with the current state that I and many others are currently in. So we may as well just get on with uh, some the, uh, the, the the questions. Let's uh, whoa. First question is coming from Azza Too Bad, and he says, "Would I still make you DC in Dead by Daylight? Um, if it was just." Um, like if we just happened to queue at the same time and you wasn't you was playing alone I think I would stand a chance I think I would stand a chance but if you were doing if we were doing kill your friends and you had I don't know like Corey and Kennedy playing as well um I do feel I would get shafted and I would get angry and I would DC like the last time but my skills as a dead by dialogue player have always been you know, subpar, and I do believe, um, you know, you underestimate me a little bit, and uh, <laughs> I'm still one of the greatest killers on the game. Man like Oz says, uh, "What's your favourite Call Me Carson moment?" Now, I'm a big fan of Call Me Carson. Um, obviously, recently he went through this whole uh, malarkey, um, but he's back now. He was streaming on Twitch the other day. I've been binge watching his videos, and uh, yeah, I'd probably say like one. Favorite moments are like I wouldn't say I have as I have one specific moment and it was the other day um, that it happened. But there's a lot of things. The video where he's recreating the map of America and it's the the whole big lion thing that kills me every single time. Um, the cursed like toilets and cursed images ones and TikTok ones. Those videos for me are just genuinely top tier. But my favorite clip. Um, my favourite moment is this one. Oh please, my friends call me Dick. <laughs> <laughs> it, it gets me every time. It gets me every time. It's just his laugh. His laugh at the end. His laugh at the end is just pure quality. Uh, Millie Jane says, "Explain why I am ginger. I need evidence." Well. Uh, this obviously has not been going on for the last couple of days. Um, I don't need to explain why you're ginger. Your profile picture right there clearly shows that you are ginger. And, um, uh, this TikTok that has been spread around explains why brown is not real. Roll the clip. The color brown doesn't exist. There's no wavelength for brown. When you see it, you're just looking at orange, but darker. Brown doesn't exist on this color wheel. The only way you can get it is if you go orange and then lower the brightness. One YouTube video I was watching on this was like, look at this boring orange square. It looks so orange. Oh shit, wait, it's brown. Tricked you, it's just the context. How do all you brunettes feel knowing that you're just darker gingers? So yeah, it's, th th that's it. That's the evidence. I've, I mean, I've got it right there. I've provided it countless times, and you're still in denial. That's all you are, a ginger in denial. Kappa. Fern asks, uh, is your dad back from the shop yet? Um, what? let's go find out, shall we? Let's take a, a wander through the depths of hell. Dad? Are you here? It's probably just playing games. <laughs> Father, it is I, your son. Are you present? It's not in the kitchen. It's not in the other living room, and it's not in the main living room. Dad? Dad? Um... I guess my dad's not actually here. I need a minute. I need... Ah! 
Uh, I don't know what that was. I guess, um... Yeah, the, the, the joke is that he's not here. That's the... Uh, anyway, it's Diana says, uh, can you promise me... Uh, no. <laughs> it's Diana says, can you promise not to forget me now? You are TikTok famous. Uh, of course, I will not forget you. And for those that do not know, um, I am TikTok famous now. Um, let me just uh, show you the digits. Um, I am TikTok famous. My notifications continue to blow up. Kappa. Um, here's my TikTok. Ginger Meme Lord 69. And I'm, you know, I'm, I'm slapping. I'm slapping, bro. I'm slapping. One TikTok in particular um, blew it up with over 463,000 views. Which is a tip top array. I just wish my YouTube videos would do the same thing. Ha ha ha. Maybe this is the start. Ha ha ha. Who knows? Come on. Views. Tyler has two questions. This is the first one of his. Will I get cuddles when quarantine is over? And then he's done the little face. Um, of course, bro. Of course. You don't even need to ask that kind of question. Just, of course. Your second question is, what are you looking forward to in the next upcoming years? Uh, well, firstly, quarantine to be over. <laughs> um, I don't know. Next couple of years, I guess it's just hit and miss. Um, most of the things I'm excited for are either movies, and TV series or games. Um, so I guess just new games, I guess, is the main thing and movies. I'm not really looking forward to much. I don't really have big aspirations. Uh, I, yeah, I'm just, I'm just here. Kurt asks, uh, what will be the first thing you do when we are all out of quarantine? <sighs> I'll probably have a wank. <laughs> I don't, I, <laughs> so probably the first thing I'll do is probably organize, like go and see friends, uh, people that I haven't seen in a long time. Uh, have a couple of drinks and stuff. I've missed a lot of people. Um, and yeah, I mean, we've already kind of spoke about it. Like the next time we we're going to see each other and stuff. Um, me and a friend have uh, definitely spoke about it. So yeah, probably going to see friends, have a drink, have a catch up and, see, and shit like that. And uh, yeah, that's probably what I'll do. Uh, the last question is from someone else called Tyler. Uh, he asks, uh, what's your opinion on volleyball? And also hope your video does great. Uh, so, f so first of all, before I answer the main question, thank you. I appreciate it. I thank you that uh, you hope my video does well. Uh, the volleyball question. Um, I mean, I like it. I, I don't mind it. I've never really watched volleyball. I used to play it when I was in school. Um, I, th I like to see. I was, I was. I was. Volleyball at school was weird for me because. Everybody else was just like, yeah, I'll do the serve. But then, like, if the ball was getting too close, especially the girls, the girls were like, oh, no, it's going to hit me. No, I'm having nothing to do with that. And then, like, yeah, it was just weird, um, to be honest. Um, I was kind of like, I gave no fucks. Well, we didn't play it outdoors. We played it inside in, like, like a laminate floor in, like, the court. And, um, yeah, it wasn't great. I, I cut myself a lot of times because of it because I was like, I'm fully committed to this. So if there was a ball further away from me, I'll be there like fucking diving across, fucking hooping it up. That, that was me. No one else would do that. Just me. But yeah, guys, that, that is all for the questions today. Um, I'll probably do like another one, like in about a week or so, a week or two. Um, until then, I'll try and pump out as much content as I possibly can. Um, yeah, but obviously I've got other priorities that I need to sort out. Um, so, yeah. I hope you did enjoy the video. If you did, feel free to leave a like. If you didn't like the video, feel free to leave a dislike. Um, leave a comment. Um, just leave a comment, boys. Come on, please. <laughs> and, uh, of course, subscribe if you are new around here. And, um, yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Whenever that way. Yeah. Bye.